The response to your, to your question. Point of order. Yes. You're, you're dealing with a very complex issue here that wasn't on the original agenda of this meeting. And I suggest we table any further discussion of that uh, so that people can have an opportunity to prepare appropriately. Got it. I come to you. That's a motion on the table. It is a complex issue, and I'm making my comments off, off the hat because I had only a chance of 72 hours to look at that. It needs considerably more research and understanding to have something tab uh, tabled on this issue right now. So, so um, can we, <coughs> absolutely, I mean, that seems to be the, we need four people to vote on something right. anyway. So, um, is there anything we can, we can tell the um, New York State Police, Dr. Perlin, etc. What they need to do then? What, what, what additional documents they would need, or what do they need to give us another presentation, or do we want to just think about it ourselves, or do we need additional material or additional um, additional presentation? But what what do you think? Um, just so we can help them, because we don't want to come to the next meeting and then the same thing happens. So, so do we need additional material? Well, I, I suggest we ask them to submit appropriate documents and ask specific questions that can be distributed to us well in advance of the next meeting and we'll have a, uh, an appropriate opportunity to think about it and come and ask intelligent, informed questions. Okay, so, um, George, any? Well, I, would, I mean, I, I, would, I would favor um, um, having a little more time to look at this. Uh, and I would go along with uh, Dr. Hirsch's suggestion that uh, we table it until the next meeting. Okay. And perhaps the next meeting could be as, as, as uh, near as uh, two or three or four months from now. It doesn't have to wait till you mm. know, six months, it seems to me. Can, okay. can I make a suggestion to be more yes. Con uh, yes. constructive? Since there is some degree of urgency or need of these from the, um, uh, in the state labs, could Barry and his associates come up with some sort of a plan as to this is what they plan to do to take the validation of uh, to a formal approval stage? The, if that material is available to us, um, as, uh, some of us might comment, could they include such and such thing before it is tabled out so that we have more time in hand to review the materials. Right, so, so uh, as Dr. Hurst suggested, what, what I think what the committee is saying is, is to the New York State Police is to please provide, could you provide the committee then as soon as you can, details of implementation plan and any further documentation you think is necessary based upon the discussions we've just had. We have a lot of material here and, and obviously the committee hasn't had appropriate time to review all of the, all of the, all of the, the material in, in detail and there's been a lot of information uh, given this morning. So, um, it, so, so, Barry, Dr. Dusman, is that clear? Is that is that clear? Do you, do you require any further clarification yeah. from, from this end? Go forward with this uh, expeditiously. Um, you would like from me an application about how we're implementing it in our laboratory and how we would have to apply it. Basically, is that what you mean by implementation plan going forward? Mm -hmm. Timeline. With the timeline. <coughs> and then in terms of additional information, um, I believe that you know, we did supply you some, but we, we you know there is additional information that may be useful. Is there anything else you'd like to see in terms of the software or you know capabilities? For example, Jamie's presentation, we don't have that here, right? We don't have Jamie's information, the, the case work summary, um, do we? It's in the report. It's in the report. The yes. information yes. report. Yes. Yeah, here's the summary of what's in the report, basically. Yes. So. The information gets present. Yeah. So I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to help the, mm -hmm. the, the people who have to do the work to, 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 to know what they should do. I mean, we have to read the material. I know that. Yeah. But whether there's anything else that, that we can get mm -hmm. uh, would help that process along would, would also be helpful to the people who's that this affects would it be appropriate to ask for a dialogue that as you review the material if you should come up with any concerns or questions that you can maybe submit them in advance I and mean, would that work or is that you know, kind of as you encounter things 
that we could bring them to the next meeting. Or... Imagine Mr. Chairman, it's, it's their proposal. I, I suggest they ought to do that, which is appropriate and necessary to get their point of view across. Mm -hmm. I move we table this and let's let's go on. I, mean, uh, I want to see the transparency of understanding the parameters for the users. I don't want. I, mean, uh, the, uh, I don't want to have through any system approved without approving Mark Parling's expertise in each casework. I want to see the transparency of understanding of the parameters for daily use. If I have to call him up every, every time, it is not yet validated for general use. But surely, surely you, uh, scientists validate something. You take, you take, you validate. There's an, an appropriate way to validate something. You look at data and you validate that yeah, data. Yeah, right. And so the question is, uh, do we have sufficient data? It's obvious that at this moment in time, this committee does not believe we have sufficient data in front of us at the moment to make a decision as to whether or not this has been appropriately validated for operational use yet. The question is, can we come to that? Can, will there be sufficient? Um, uh, uh, will there be a sufficient knowledge base at the next meeting? that will enable us to, to make a decision one way or the other. So that, I suppose that's the question. So it's now incumbent upon um, the, you know, the, the user, New York State Police, to provide the committee with any, any additional documentation that you feel necessary to, to, to help uh, uh, us understand that the validation process has taken place. Mm -hmm. In other words, here's the here's a question, here's a validation, this is why, why we believe this is a valid uh, uh, approach. So I think Jamie did, Jamie touched on certain parts of this. Mm -hmm. just showed a couple of cases. It's mm -hmm. only a small snapshot, and we haven't seen, I, do, I didn't see the, all, all mm -hmm. the, uh, the illegals. I haven't done that myself and looked at these myself. Well, there is the time constraint. Yes, yes. So, so maybe that would be a, you know, just to help you, mm -hmm. something in much more detail as to yeah. the cases and how you've done it and what the results actually show in terms of summarizing that data. Mm -hmm. You have it already somewhere. It's probably just we haven't uh, fully, fully seen it. Is that? Anyway, so, so the, the motion on the table is to, is to table this this, uh, this um, discussion, uh, the consideration of the true validation to the next next meeting. Sure. So, um, all those in favour, it's been seconded. Um, all those in favour of doing that, say aye. Yeah. Aye. So we'll, we'll table it to the next meeting. <laughs>